This is Clint from the Farmer's Grove out here this morning. It's starting to cool off finally. And uh, I'm using my scythe and I'm getting a lot of biomass. There, it, the, good th the cool thing about a scythe is it allows you to pile stuff up and carry stuff and you don't lose so much material like you do with a weed eater. So I'm about got this done. I'm putting it around the pawpaw trees. But the, when I posted the last video when I said scythe, apparently a lot of people that are not used to the romantic, beautiful, ultra cool language of a Appalachian Southerner, that is what I'm talking about when I say scythe. Um, you know, some people said, you mean like the Grim Reaper? Uh, yeah, you know, and that's one of those things. After someone said that, I mean, I've seen pictures, the Grim Reaper with one of these. I really don't know how you would use it against a person, but it does look wicked. Now, this one has a weed blade on it. I've got some that have brush blades on them, and I have some that have grass blades on them. And the scythe, that I believe, is one of the most underutilized tools in permaculture that I've seen when people, you know, when people go about doing things because it allows you to gather so much biomass so quick. It's actually faster than a weed eater. There is technique that you have to learn. Once you get it down, that is one bad tool right there.